What's up everyone? This is Ryan again with another review. Right now what I'm going to do is just review the stuff I'm keeping from the accessory set. Uh, as I said in my previous video with the baby turtles, uh, I was running out of tape, running out of room. I always say run out of tape. I'm still living in 2001. Uh, so basically what I'm keeping is the TV, uh, the Nintendo system with the Atari like controllers. That's in a Super Nintendo. I, I don't care what anybody tells me. It doesn't have the right controllers, but I don't care. It looks dope. We have the pizza that comes in the pizza box. As I said in the previous video with the turtles, you could cut these apart if you wanted to. It'd be very easily with a, uh, excuse me, it'd be very easy with a razor blade or X-Acto knife, but I'm not gonna do that. But you could do it, it'd be easy. We have the pizza box with the hinge to close. Pretty simple, pretty easy. Pretty basic, and then we have these cute, cute. You know what? I'm gonna show you them on the pizza just as a platform, it'll be easier for me. Pizza monsters, I'll give you a side profile. Hold on. Yeah, they look good. The, all the sculpts and paint jobs came out good. So I know a lot of you are already noticing, what the heck, bro? How did you get Aqua Teen Hunger Force on their TV? Well, first off, I have stickers already. And when I saw all these different individual channels, I'll go through them for you if you want. Bill O'Neill, Dinosaur on TV, The Wrestling Turtle, The Video Game, some kind of blob wannabe Vernon Rocksteady and Bebop Ace the Duck One of the turtles on TV And then April and Neil again Now it's very simple what I did guys I took one of these Then I took a sticker that I like that matched up the size somewhat like I had to put the sticker against this and then see if the image I wanted fit in the frame and I found two stickers that did and then I basically just cut around it using the 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 actual slide as a as a guide so yeah and I'll do that for you now TV opens up as you can see it's very, it's got a lot, it's very spacious so you could put the other slides in there if you wanted to it's an easy just take it right out and then just easy just throw it back in okay and you, you touch here to take them out in case you're like how do I get this out just go like that okay and then just put the top back on now heads up if you put by the way I am aware I heard somebody tell me I know I say heads up a lot it's a thing I don't care all right I know y'all might not either anyway if you put the slides in here be careful because there's a, a nub right here, like a little bump here. And if they're in the middle, it won't close all the way. So make sure the, the, the slides are all the way to the front or the back, or just maybe not put them in there at all, depending on how you want to do it. I'm going to put them in there because I'll definitely lose them. And then as an extra touch, this VCR actually has a, a slot open for the tape, for the one single tape, because we didn't get two, remember? <laughs> Um, nice job, Mecca, on this though. Seriously, I don't really care that we didn't get a second tape. This TV alone is just so well done. Yeah, my baby turtles are gonna be watching the most inappropriate stuff late at night while Splinter is sleeping, and it's okay because that's how I got raised. Aqua Teen Hunger Force. Now, let me stop. Um, this is pretty much it, guys. Uh, I'm thinking about keeping other stuff like the robots, but uh. I don't know. And I apologize for anybody who's like, please show us the other stuff. I can't because I've already decided I'm not gonna keep them. So I wanna keep them in their mint, as near mint as possible condition so that we don't have to worry about anything else. So 
sorry about the pause there. So when I say not worry about everything else, I literally mean, uh, you know, somebody saying, oh, but you opened it, oh, but it's scratched, oh, but it's damaged, oh, but this and that. So the way I'm making sure that never happens is that I'm just never going to take them out of the package. They're staying in there. Big Mac, uh, the little mouser, the, sh uh, the, the, what do you call it? What's his name? Baxter's uh, shredder head, the Rocksteady. I'm getting rid of all that. So I'll let you guys know when I do. Just going to give you a quick preview. Yes, I know my robots are a mess. I'm working on something right now and I just said, screw it, I'll lay them down so they don't keep knocking down. Except Iron Giant, he's never knocking down. Okay, anyway, back to turtles. Here's where the turtles are going. And the turtles look great together. I have to be honest, like this just makes me so happy. I've been seeing this image in my head since since they reviewed or excuse me since they exposed that leaked picture of these guys and i'm thinking about selling that four pack up top signed by kevin eastman but that's painful to me I'm like i have them already so they're open and they're out and this is what i really wanted but like damn man i don't know if i can do it i may have to though because you know money's a thing but anyway these are the focus right here. These are amazing. I'm gonna get another angle. And I apologize for the shakiness. It's HD on uh, Raphael there. There we go. And these guys look great. So yeah, this is it. This is where they're gonna be, and I'm gonna add on that second row in the middle is gonna have more turtles, and there's gonna be more and more turtles. Yeah. So, thank you for watching, guys. I really appreciate everyone who's checking out my videos. I'm just starting. I'm still a, a noob, as they would say, but I'm getting there. All right. Uh, stay tuned for more v reviews and more videos. Peace, peace.